Hey guys, what's up? So sorry that I haven't posted a cover in over a week. Sometimes I get into these ruts where I'll record a song and I'll listen to it and I'll be like, this sucks. I'm sure that it doesn't suck, but in my brain I'm like, yeah, this sucks. So then I delete it and I don't post anything. So, but today we're gonna record a cover. And in my last video, I got a lot of requests to kind of see my setup and how I record a cover. So I'm gonna take you guys behind the scenes as I record this cover today. Um, we are doing Walk in the Wire by Imagine Dragons. So let's jump into it. Hey guys, voiceover Lauren here. So for starters, this is my PreSonus AudioBox USB. And this just allows me to plug in my condenser mic and my guitar. And then this is a USB, so it just plugs right into my laptop. And this also comes with its own program called Studio One, which I will show you in a second. But yeah, so basically this is just a, an audio box and you can adjust the levels and all that fun stuff. And then for my mic, I use the MXL 990 condenser microphone. Um, and then I also have the shock mount that just hooks up to my mic stand and that just holds it all together. And then I also bought a pop filter. This one was rather cheap. I'm sure that you can get better ones, but that is what I use. So like I said, the PreSonus Audio Box comes with its own program called Studio One. Um, and this one is Studio One Artist. I believe there's like a, an upgraded version you can get, but this is just what came with the box. And it's really easy to use. I really like it. And I'll show you guys more of this towards the end of the video after I record my cover. So that is all the equipment that I use. And then of course I have my guitar. And this is a Takamine, Takamine? Uh, I'm not sure how to pronounce it. But it's a Takamine, Takamine G Series acoustic electric guitar. And yeah, it's a great guitar, I love it. Let's get into recording this cover. And the camera that I'm talking to right now is the camera that I used to record. So I'm gonna set you guys up, um, but I'll keep recording. I have a little behind the scenes of setting up the camera. Might be a little shaky, so sorry about that. Oh, and of course, I dropped the little clip. <laughs> okay, set you guys right in there. It can go in, there you go. Crazy well. Ooh. So I normally kind of angle a little bit down. Gotta get my angles. Then, my mic over here. I don't know how well this pop filter works, but I use it anyway. Okay. So, that's all set up. This is so exciting. I'm sure it's so exciting. Oh. And then, I use just little headphones that plug into the back of my pre sonus USB audio box so I can hear myself and make sure that I sound good. I feel like you guys are a little far away. Oh. Don't do it. Don't do it. Headphones in. Uh, okay. And then I have like a couple of saved songs in my Studio One and I'll just like go in and open those because they have like all my files set up. So, let's get into this cover. Hopefully I can do it. <laughs> All right, see you on the other side. We took the step and we took the leap. I messed up. Uh, uh. <sighs> we could turn up. Excuse me, headphones, please stay in my ears. There's lights from heaven and better me. I just burped. <laughs> We're walking. Dang it! I messed that part up. <sighs> okay. The cover is recorded. So I just went back through and listened to it. And it sounds pretty good. But I'll go through and add kind of some double vocals where I think it's needed or any harmonies. I'm not sure if I'll do any of those with this one, but um, I'll go back in here. So I'll show you guys kind of what that looks like. So this is Studio One. So if you can see that top one is my vocals, the bottom one is my guitar, and I can edit how loud that is and how loud that is. And then I have an extra track in here where I'll go in and just add vocals where it's needed. And then I will upload the video and export this audio and in Premiere, 
I will just line up the audio and cut the video and hit export and upload on YouTube. And that is how I do a cover. So I'm gonna record these extra vocals and then edit this video and my cover and hopefully these will be up very soon. So thanks for watching. Hopefully this was a little bit entertaining or educational. Um, if you have any other questions, definitely leave them below and I'll answer them. And again, all the links to all my gear and equipment and stuff is in the description below. So you can go check that stuff out. And again, this is just what I use. There's definitely better stuff out there but I'm just beginning and diving into this whole recording thing. So this is what was recommended to me. So I will recommend it to you. So thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys later. Bye.